Melody here. You might know me as Apple Pie Movement. Welcome to my new series, Don't Be a Karen. Now, you might be asking yourself, hmm, what is a Karen? Come on, let's go check it out. While his hand shakes uncontrollably, his resolve is unflinching. A CVS manager captured on cell phone video in Chicago as he calls 911 because of a coupon controversy. African-American. Black. No, I'm not African-American. I'm black. Black isn't a bad word. The man calls the police on a black customer attempting to use the coupon seen here. They never tried to process the coupon. They never scanned it. This morning, Camilla Hudson is speaking out. She's the woman behind the camera and the voice you can hear in the video. She goes, well, I can't accept this. So I said, okay, why can't you accept it? Because it looks fraudulent. That's when she says that CVS manager, Maury Matson dialed nine. Hey guys, if you like, don't be a Karen. Please like and comment below. And if you come across any Karens, please send me the footage for a future episode. <laughs> Thanks. You're already criminalized when you're wearing black skin, says Darren Martin, a former Obama White House staffer who was mistaken for a burglar while moving into his apartment in New York City. Darren's story of being questioned by neighbors and police for simply being black in an allegedly white space isn't unique, nor is the outcry it sparked on social media. In Rialto, California, a group of African Americans were detained by police while checking out of their Airbnb rental when a neighbor accused them of stealing stuff. The neighbor was also concerned that the group hadn't waved to them. Thank you so much for joining another episode of Don't Be a Karen. Remember, without you, there is no movement. Please like, subscribe, comment, and let me know of any Karens you find. Please send me the footage.